Hi, I'm Fred Lange, and this is an encounter with the TIV, the tornado intercept vehicle I saw during a storm chase in Kansas this spring. It's a Mad Max kind of looking vehicle, very home built, but incredibly sturdy. It survived 14 encounters with tornadoes so far, or intercepts as they call them. It began life as a Ford F450, and here you can see them changing the filters after a day on the dusty roads of Kansas the day before. Bulletproof glass, lots of glazing putty. Thing weighs 14,000 pounds. They're very casual about letting people poke around inside, so we did. You can see it's very, very roughly finished. Everything's padded, for both for soundproofing and to prevent uh, bumps and bruises as the thing is tossed around. These retractable claws help steady the vehicle in side winds. Here we're moving around towards the back, and you can see the dual tires. There's two tires in front, four tires in back altogether. Here's the rear of the vehicle. Look at the glazing putty. This is very, very roughly finished. It's built for strength, not beauty. Here we're going to go in the side door. First we'll take a close-up look at the uh, left-hand claw. There's a jump seat in the back facing forward on the passenger side and one facing rearward on the driver's side. The turret on top is meant to hold an IMAX camera and they're trying to film the inside of a tornado. They do collect meteorological data as they go along and here's a clean side shot. We actually saw the vehicle in operation out on the roads of uh, Kansas while we were chasing a storm. The storm here is off out of frame to the left. We're in the very strong inflow wind. You'll notice the grass waving as the TIV pulls up. Had a hard time holding the camera still, both uh, because this was uh, at zoom range and also because the very gusty 30 mile an hour wind was knocking me around. This was an unexpected encounter. I didn't have my tripod, so this is uh, handheld. Looks like the TIV has uh, given up something in turning radius. It's a very clumsy vehicle, but moves right along. They can they can haul when they have to. It's pretty interesting and a real-life Mad Max encounter.